So I've been working on a 3D model for a sci-fi weapon, and I wanted to show how to use the bevel shader with this because it uh, produced really good results. So let's take a look at the shading, and I'm gonna grab one of these objects, and it really is pretty simple. All we have to do is press shift A and type in bevel and we can create this node and we can pipe it into the normal on our material. And in this case, I, I think the default is maybe 0 0.05 and for this particular object, I reduced it to 0 0.01. And let's take a look at the, the difference here if we add this versus not adding it. So let this I'll let this render for a second. So we can see in some of these crevices, there's some smooth edges and things. If I disable this, all this detail goes away. We, we lose these highlights, we lose the smoothness, everything's too sharp, it's really boring. We can, we can hardly see some of these details, but when we add this back, we get all of this detail back into the, into the model. And this is all based on the shader. It's not even part of the geometry. So with that, I'm able to use, if I go into wireframe here, or perhaps even go to solid and select everything. The, the model I'm using is, is probably a little bit too low poly, but it certainly works for this demonstration. And uh, yeah, it's, it's um, kind of your typical, polygon non all quad setup but uh, even though we don't have a lot of detail in these crevices and we don't have a lot of these tiny bevels we're still able to add it back using the bevel shader and we get fantastic results and again that looks like this once it's rendered so just wanted to show that if you know you need a quick way to render and generate bevels I highly recommend the bevel shader and uh, also keep in mind that let's say if you need to export your model to another renderer or, an, uh, or another software, then consider baking that normal information. I believe that's possible. That's outside of the scope of what we can cover here, but that's also something to consider. So yeah, a lot of great, a lot of great detail, a lot of um, interesting interesting highlights and details that come from that. So definitely recommend checking that out. If you liked this video, please consider subscribing, liking this video, sharing this video with friends, and hitting the notification bell to stay up to date.